Okay, this is a coast down test for a, um, a inertia dynamometer. Where we're trying to measure the uh, friction and the windage of the uh, Kaiho wheel down there. We have to spin it up to 2000 uh, RPM using the motorcycle and then lift the back of the motorcycle off the dyno for the toe coat down test. We'll see how we go. fast and it's, it's looking stationary and that noise you can hear is just coming from the wheel itself. Uh, there's a lot of wind coming off it, there's a lot of rushing noise. It's really honking. Really, really honking. And the, um, the slab is vibrating a bit and it's almost, there's a, there's a dull rumble, like a slight earthquake. It's really quite amazing. Um, the amount of energy that's stored in this thing is, is ridiculous. I'd hate to, hate to think what would happen if the thing let loose, but as, uh, I've built the thing pretty, pretty heavily, so I'm fairly confident nothing, um, nothing crazy is going to happen. Touch wood. You can see the, uh, the wheels nicely off the dyno wheel. Now I've got to punch the... Um, got about 1800 RPM i to hit the start button for the coast down test and then wait um, around 20 minutes. It takes about 20 minutes for this thing to, um, to coast down. And then uh, the software will be uh, hit again and uh, automatically calculate friction in the wheel and the windage and the drum and, all, and the, the bearings and all that sort of stuff and incorporate it into, uh, into future dyno runs. So that's, uh, that's, that's a wonderful thing. You can see the arrangement we've got here with a block and tackle up to the roof where we hoiked the back of the bike and it all seemed to work really well and uh, fairly safe which is a damn fine thing. Okay, yeah, we'll report back soon.